Nabwin Zono Agricultural Research and Development Institute in Lolenge Duat Sub County, Nabila Tuk District, is responsible for producing technologies that can fit the two arid areas of Teso and Karamoja sub regions. The institute has technologies for both crop and animal husbandry. Dr. Paul Boma is a livestock scientist at Nabwin Zadi. So that is one attribute. But one thing, they will produce a very small calf, but that calf, once, once delivered, grows so fast. The feed conversion is very good, very, very big. And within nine months, that animal is weighing between 150 to 190 kilograms live weight, which it cannot be acquired by the calves. Boma narrates how the institute is overwhelmed by the high demand for artificial insemination. We have had a, a, a group of farmers from, from Amodat totaling to 256. They came together, they, we, we asked them to go to the district veterinary officer's office and register and they have given us that number. And then in Kotido, we have uh, 132 farmers. Relatedly, the institute also operates a 400-acre farm for sorghum and green gram, which is seed multiplication to benefit farmers in the region. In more than 30 years, we have now able to generate seeds. And our expectation is that we may get up to 50 metric tons of seed in this investment. Now we're addressing the problem of a quality of seed. Yes. So you supported mm. the narrow Nabuin to produce it for Karamoja, mm. and here is the seed. According to Nabuin Ezadi Director Dr. Paul Okolo, the institute needs 2.5 billion to extend their technologies to the nine districts of Karamoja. About 2.5 billion in order for us to reach almost each and every district in at least a fair way and also be able to scale these technologies to the farmers, in particular the vulnerable community. To get water for irrigation, we need support to be able to till. We have a small uh, uh, mechanization unit of 25 uh, tractors, but we need to expand on that. The Minister for Karamoja Affairs, Dr. Mary Goreti Chitutu, and State Minister Agnes Nandutu commend the works at Nabuin Zadi. Farmers. You've heard that 18,000 farmers are going to benefit from this. The Green Gram, we have around 115 farmer groups who are going to benefit. Then we, so we need more money into this to support this center. The perennial crops, we are looking at grapes, dates, we are looking at olives, we are looking at cocoa, such that this becomes coffee. a multiplication mm. center, even coffee for the people of Karamoja. The Ministry of Karamoja Affairs, through a memorandum of understanding, gave Nabuin Zadi and Namalu prisons 500 million shillings each. Nabuin is expected to multiply seed for the farmers in the region, while Namalu prisons is to produce food for the people affected by hunger in Karamoja through Karamoja Feeds, Karamoja Program. Dr. Kitutu said Karamoja Ministry is doing a lot to stabilize and develop Karamoja adding that the food at Namalu will be given to Karenga, Abim and Kotido districts which are said to be affected.